So for today, we're going to be looking at the new spooky spider armor that got introduced in the TWAB. I am actually pretty interested because they are bringing a few changes that I think are sorely needed. But if you guys like the video, like, comment, subscribe, uh, let me know which armor set you guys are interested in, because I think both of them have like are really good for all the classes. But if I'm being honest, there is one that I immediately like, and it's probably for a reason you guys might think. So again, like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what charmer sets you want to see. But other than that, let's look into it. So the first one is really cool. Personally, I think this is the better armor set just because a lot of the pieces are very symmetrical. And honestly, that's really it. I love the spider theme. I love the webbing. The webbing is so cool. And I really hope this armor set wins because of the webbing specifically for the hunter i think the hunter set looks super dope everything is symmetrical the only issue i can see people having is the fact that this armor set is very specific uh, as like it's bug themed or arachnid themed I, sh I should say and i get that but at the same time uh you can definitely make it work i definitely could see people using the boots for the hunters for like uh actually not even the hunters i think the boots for everyone looks amazing for like a like a hive themed set because it just would look super cool but again i think hive set would look really cool with this arachnid set so as for the next set i think let me let me get this out of the way i think it looks super super cool i think it all looks awesome my only gripe and i don't know why they said arachnid theme because this is more like beetle themed um a lot of it is just the fact that it's very asymmetrical specifically the arms actually like the arms are the only piece that are very asymmetrical uh for the titan and hunter for the warlocks uh warlocks actually look pretty cool but i think the other set just looks a lot better personally i think the green set just looks way better the orange set don't get me wrong looks cool um but this is like the first time i'm like at either or the all the other cool thing is that the armor sets are not contingent on like, oh, well, the hunters have a really cool set, so they will, they'll most likely win this one. Um, it's actually class based voting now. Thank God they probably saw that from last Halloween, because last Halloween, I'm pretty sure every hunter voted, voted for the other set and all the other classes voted for the armor that they won, because uh, I do think hunters got gypped hard last last uh, Halloween. So I am excited for them to actually do it class based instead of just the regular uh, vote whatever you want. So instead of uh, like for me, hunters, I think have the better green armor. So I'm going to vote for that one. But for the other classes, uh, I'm actually I'm going to be real with you. I think the green armor just looks better overall compared to the orange set. I know a lot of hunters are going to immediately go for the orange one just because it has glows. But I do think the better pieces is the uh the green set just because the green set um just has a lot more to offer personally don't get me wrong i do think the bottom piece are this set right here is going to be better for for hive themed stuff just because there is a lot more carapace pieces but i just think this set looks way cooler i think the webbing is just so so cool because the hunters have it on right here you guys can see it right there uh the warlocks you can see it from the robe itself and then the mark for the titans is actual webbing so i think that's super metal but yeah let me know what you guys think in the comments below again i i'm actually pretty excited for this armor set it looks really cool and i'm at a point where i'm either or because if the green set wins then i'm gonna use a lot of these pieces for a lot of other things because it just looks cool but if the hunters get this bottom one i'm also okay with it because uh the cloak looks really cool i don't know if this horn is connected to the actual cloak or the helmet if it's the helmet that's going to be really cool if it's the mark or the cloak then i'm okay with that but the boots definitely i'm going to use it for like a hive theme set uh the arms maybe i don't know there's a lot of things i can do with this set for the, for the hunters but for this one there's also a lot of things i can do and uh, the boots definitely look super cool. The arms are super cool because they're symmetrical, which is something I love. Uh, for the Titans, I I think the better choice is the green one. I just think a lot of these pieces are way cooler. Your chest piece has like these like uh, legs or thing, whatever. They, that's super cool. Uh, for the bottom one, I think the only thing that I don't like is the arms. Just the asymmetry really bugs me. It's always bugged me. But the helmet is super dope. The chest piece looks super dope. The boots look super dope. And I think the mark is the only thing that's like also like eh, whatever. 
So the arms asymmetry is what bugs me in the mark is just kind of like whatever but like for the titan for this one the the webbing for the cloak for the mark is super cool i think the arms look super cool they're symmetrical as well uh the boots also are symmetrical technically i say technically because there it seems like webbing is going to be on both sides but different spots but that's so small that i don't really care and the helmet i think is is kind of weak like it looks cool but at the same time uh i don't know they could have it could have looked a little bit more scary or beefy uh, for the warlocks. I actually think the chest piece for this one looks really cool. The arms are symmetrical and they look cool. The like talons at the back of this is also super cool. I think the helmet looks pretty cool. I think a lot of these pieces look cool. I think the only thing that looks boring is the bond because I didn't even notice the bond until I actually looked at it. So the bond is like the only thing that's like whatever. But other than, other than that, everything else looks fucking cool. Um. The bottom piece for the warlocks i'm gonna be real with you guys a lot of this set looked kind of like boring um i don't know what it is it's just kind of meh like it's very meh uh i don't know i i definitely like the shoulder plates like right here i think these are cool i think the helmet looks okay i know a lot of warlocks are gonna get mad at the fact that they just have another visor thing right here uh, which is valid because that's all you guys really have most of the time it would have been cool if you guys had like something like this where it's just like two isolates or even go a little bit more bug bug eyed or with it uh, like have multiple eyes on it and just have each of them glowing that would have been cool as well uh boots is fine i, I don't know man i think the warlocks that you, you guys definitely want the top one just because it looks a lot more unique than this one so like if i were a guessing or betting man i would probably go with Warlocks are going to choose this one. Hunters are probably going to choose this one. And Titans are probably going to choose this one just because of the arm, the punchy arm. But I would I would go for this one. For me, I would go with the green set all around. Like, it's rough, though, because I think this these are the better boots if you want to go for a hive theme. Because this one, as, as much as I think it looks so cool, I don't think this one will make a good hive themed piece because this one is just pure carapace. So let me know what you guys think. Again, I'm actually really excited for these armor sets. They look really, really cool. But again, let me know what you guys think. Be safe and I'll see you guys later.